Hello everybody, welcome back to my channel. This is Eileen with Unique Gifts and Decor by Lady Di. Happy, happy Tuesday again to everybody. I am hoping everyone is enjoying your day. I hope you got a chance to go out and get some of these goodies that I found at the Dollar Journal today. You know, they had the Easter items. Um, 90% today, not the candy. I think the candies were 70, 70, 75%. I think it's 70%. Yes, yeah, 70, excuse me. But um, wasn't looking for candy. Was just looking for some items that I can use toward Father's Day. Now, you all say, we haven't got past Mother's Day. But I really was looking for some baskets. And I really got a lot of baskets. And you all can see in my previous haul today. And I kind of explained how I shopped and what I was shopping for. And what I was using those, I, I will be using those items for. So if you get a chance to go back and look at my previous video that I put out today. So let's get started. Let me show you guys what I was working on. So the reason, let me start, stop. The reason why I'm not on camera right now, is because um, I was out shopping today. I had my baseball cap on, my sweats, because it was cold down here today, this morning. I think I woke up and it was like 39, something like that. So it was cold when I went out a little bit this morning. So um, I had planned to go get my mulch, and I explained that in my um, video. Um, I never got to Lowe's when, this morning when I was supposed to because my car was so full of stuff from these hauls that I said, okay, I'll do that later. But anyway, after I did my haul, um, I did go up to Lowe's um, after I packed and put everything away. And I did get my mulch, but what I have been doing is I had to... I planted some flowers Saturday, so the seeds, I had to water the seeds. Um, I had to uh, water the f hanging baskets that I did get, and the mulch I did get, I had to put that down. So, I am very, very casual today, okay? Um, usually when I put on clothes in the morning, what I have on, I have on. What y'all see me on camera is what I put on for the day. I do not get dressed up for the camera. I don't have time to do all that to be changing clothes 24 hours a day, two, two, three times a day. I don't have to, I, I'm not going to do that and I don't do that. Usually in the morning times, I have clients that I go see. I have customers that I, potential customers that I am going to see. And I have, <clears throat> excuse me, businesses that I have to go in and uh, basically do presentations for them, for their, for their employees, for insurance or whatever they need. And plus, I am seeking potential business clients uh, that I can use for my gift basket business. So you guys... I have to look presentable when I'm going out, or you sh and you should too if you are going out meeting people for business. So that's the reason why y'all see me, you know, I don't say I'm dressed up, but I'm looking presentable because I've seen some, and I'm not knocking anybody, but I will never be up there on camera with my a bonnet, um, hair rollers, pajamas, stuff like that. That's not how I was raised. And you always supposed to look presentable at all times, not knocking anybody. If that's what you do, then that's fine. But the way I was raised, um, that was not going to be presentable in my home. And even when my parents were both deceased, if I would do that, honey, they would probably come back here and haunt me, okay? But anyway, all that being said, um, I just wanted to show you guys these um, throws that I got today from the Dollar General. Um, I had some ideas how I wanted to do these throws, you guys. Um, and I said I was going to wait till maybe later, maybe this fall, do something for the fall festival. But my my baby in my spirit started leaping at me, you guys. <laughs> and I just could not get this idea out of my head because I knew in when I was going down the aisles in the Dollar Journal and I saw them and I knew what I needed to do to make this um, concept come to uh, pass. Okay. So this is the first one that I've got here. Now these crates that I am using, uh, we got them from the harvest sale during the Dollar General, uh, at the Dollar General, I think it was after Thanksgiving, maybe sometime in December, maybe when all of the clearance stuff, uh, the harvest stuff had, um, trickled down in these, uh, percentages. Well, I didn't get this at the 90%. I saw them at the 70% at one of the stores that I've never gone in before. So this is uh, some of the uh, finds that I got in that store. I used, I thought I used all of them that I had for Valentine's Day. But when I cleaned out my garage after Valentine's Day, you guys, I found 
some stuff under the tables when I store my stuff. I just push stuff aside and I found some more of these totes. So these crates, excuse me, I've got two large ones and two medium sized ones. So this is where the crate came in, if you all asked, wanted to know. Now the crate, um, I did put a box inside the crate and I put some tissue paper on top of the uh, box. Okay, so that's why the items are standing up. Now, these flowers were from the harvest sale from Dollar Journal. And when they all pinned out, they had all these flowers. I got a bunch of the flowers. These roses that I stuck in here are from Timu, okay? So I kind of did a mixture of the flowers here. Um, the vase I got from the Dollar Journal doing the, uh, I think it was the green dot. So I ended up, um, I've had two of those left. I used some of those for Valentine's Day, but I have two left. These prayer cards, you all know, we get those from the Dollar General. I mean, excuse me, Dollar Tree. The embellishments in here, they are from the Harvest uh, Collection. Now, they were, um, let's see, they were um, at the Harvest Sale. And I think they came in a bag, a plastic bag. I think it may be 12 or more different sizes in the bag. So, by me having the flowers here, I didn't want to put embellishment of a flower because that's just been too much. So that's why I ended up doing these circle balls. I think they're pretty, pretty cool. Now I've got this antique leather candle from the Dollar General. This sweat, sweater weather cup was from the Harvest sale at the Dollar General. That was doing the penny a sale. I got that as well. Also these, I think this is so cute. It's a baking, it's a two piece baking set. It's the ba ba uh, baking pan and the spatula. Y'all, I got these. These was a penny. I love them. I, I racked up. I thought those were the cutest things. And also, as y'all know, the, I've got the um, throw. And I also got this body set from it's the Good Bass Sunshine Day. And this is from the Dollar General when they had that clearance in February. It's the body wash and the lotion. So, guys, this is what I put in here, um, and I made this bow here that I'm going to add to it, um, and I will probably do a short once I get it all um, wrapped up for you. But, you guys, this is it. Now, sometimes baskets tell stories, okay? So, this is the story about this basket. So, first, you're going, it's kind of relaxation basket because you got to throw, you're going to take your little shower, you're going to, or uh, bubble bath or whatever you do. You got the smell goods here. You got your candles to kind of, the ambiance for the room. Then the prayer card, if you want to meditate and read some scriptures while you're meditating, that's fine. So you're going to get out the tub. You're going to go in your room or wherever your little reading nook. You're going to get your book or read or sit down and watch TV. You got your throw and you got your floor arrangement to, on your little table. And you want to bake you some banana bread or maybe some strudel or something. And you got you some hot tea or coffee. I mean, this is just going to be a relaxation basket, okay? Y'all got me? Y'all feel me? <laughs> so let's go over to this next one. It's the same pretty much concept, the, t the crate. Uh, a box is inside the crate with the tissue paper. Same throw here. Same floor arrangement. The only difference is I put a pop of the uh, teal turquoise themes in this one, okay? Same vase from the Dollar General. I've got a loofah that I got here. And I got this pumpkin uh, candle dish. Now, it's a plastic, but you can use this, put candy in, or you can have it at your office and put your paper clips or something like that, you know, those, or sticky notes, something in here, it's, 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 they'll fit in there. Um, I've got my baking dish with the spatula here. I've got this pomegranate and harvest candle here. That was also at the harvest sale. Now this cup, um, mug I got from the harvest sale for penny at the harvest sale. This exfoliating gloves I got from Ollie's the other week. And also to top it off, I've got the uh, body wash and the body so a uh, lotion, excuse me, from the good baths from the Dollar General. And I have this bow here that I am going to wrap it with. Um, so you guys, what do you think? <laughs> 
same scenario, same story for this basket as well. Um, you, you're in your tub, you've got the bubble stuff going on, you got your candle, you got your loofah to kind of get yourself together. Then once you get out, you've got, you know, got you, you baked you something, but you drank you some hot tea, coffee, cocoa, whatever it is. And, um, you got a floor arrangement to sit on the watch TV and you can get you, put you some candy in there. If not, you can take it to your office and put it on your desk. Okay. So you guys, let me know what you think. Is this something that you all, some of these items that you all have that you all can put together to do this? It was very simple to put together. I just got so excited, you guys. It was in my belly. I had to get this baby out, but I just knew in my mind, in my head, how I wanted to make these ha this happen. I thought maybe I'll just make it happen for fall. But you know what? It doesn't really look fall because of the colors. Um... Even the orange cannot just be for fall. It can be for any season, you guys. So I thought that kind of, um, this is the colors kind of made me bring all this out, to be honest, the colors that's in here, okay? So let me know what you all think I should charge for this. Um, I will probably come back and do a short um, and showing you guys how I wrap them both. Um, but again, um, you guys let me know what you think, okay? So thank you for watching this video, and honey, y'all please pray for me. I hope I get all this out of me, because I've got to go do some studying. <sighs> but I just had to finish this today, that you guys, it was just eating me up. So let me know what you think. Please like, share, comment. Um, please also hit the notification button, because I will be uploading some videos. Um, I'm going to try to at least do one a week. I've got till Friday to finish all my stuff. I really got to the 30th, but I'm... I'm giving myself till Friday to finish all those courses so that I can get um, get that out of the way. So, you guys have a good evening, and don't forget to let me know what you think I need to charge. I kind of like this one more, but you know, I'm, I'm colorful, so I like the teal too. So, you all let me know which one do you all prefer. And once I put that bow on it, you guys, mm, it's going to be off the chain. Till the next video, you guys, please be blessed. Bye-bye.